Hi and how are you all today? I am Priyanka. The question says, prove that the coefficient of x raised to the power n in 1 plus x raised to the power 2n is twice the coefficient of x raised to the power n in 1 plus x raised to the power 2n minus 1. Before proceeding on with the solution, we should be well versed with the general term in the expansion of 1 plus x raised to the power 2n. That is, if we have to find the 1 plus r plus 1 term, it will be equal to C 2n comma r x raised to the power r. Now if we put r is equal to n we have t n plus 1 is equal to C 2n. Now in place of r we have n so we have this. Now the coefficient of x raised to the power n above we have c 2n comma n. Right. Let this be the first equation. Similarly, for 1 plus x raised to the power 2n minus 1, the coefficient of x raised to the power n will be what? It will be equal to c 2n minus 1 comma n. Now according to the question, let this be the second equation. According to the question given to us, we have to prove that C 2n comma n is equal to twice the coefficient of x raised to the power n in 1 plus x raised to the power 2n minus 1. That is c 2n minus 1 comma n. Now we need to prove this thing. So we have 2n factorial divided by n factorial 2n minus n factorial. And here it can be written as 2 multiplied by 2n minus 1 factorial divided by n factorial in bracket 2n minus 1 minus n factorial. In solving, we have 2n factorial divided by n factorial. 2n minus n factorial will be n factorial itself is equal to 2 multiplied by 2n minus 1 factorial divided by n factorial and here it can be written as n minus 1 factorial as on subtracting n from 2n we are left with n and then we have minus 1. Further To n factorial divided by n factorial, n factorial is equal to 2 multiplied by 2n minus 1 factorial divided by n factorial, n minus 1 factorial. Now here, on multiplying, the numerator 
and the denominator by n on RHS we have In LHS, we have n fact, 2n factorial divided by n factorial n factorial. Now, on this, we have 2n, 2n minus 1 factorial divided by n factorial n, n minus 1 factorial. That is, Now here, this can be written as 2n factorial only. This in the numerator can be written as 2n factorial. n factorial, now n, n minus 1 factorial is the expansion of n factorial only. So LHS will be equal to RHS and hence we have proved the required given thing. This ends the question. Take care.